<laughs> oh guys good morning everybody it is a beautiful morning on the homestead it is absolutely gorgeous all the animals are excited we need to get mowing on this side we've been mowing 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 and this grass over here needs to be mowed but first these animals need to get fed so oh yep she is red he she is ready aren't you aren't you yeah you are for sure ready okay ladies hold on protection board to keep them back. Ladies. There we go. So that is just the, my board that goes on the feed tote. I discovered that the other day. I'm fighting over their food. Okay, well, we'll come back and water those guys. Um, time to take care of these chickens. Trying not to get bit. Ow! <laughs> Mom 
Mama. Oh, it's too late to go broody. Too late. Sorry. It's too late to go broody. Three eggs on the ground. Sometimes they bury them, especially uh, Polly. She buries her eggs. Okay. You guys want some eggs? back with some water for you guys, some fresh water. How about that? Smooth, nice, nice little wallow for them. Some fresh water. They're scared of my uh, my yellow board. Maybe that's why they make it yellow. This is not a pig board, but uh, pig boards are about sixty dollars. Um, so we're making one, and until mine is made. This will work. Hopefully. The bigger they get, the harder it gets. Now to turn the water off and then back on. <laughs> we share water with the garden or straight out of the well. This is this is a 360. Um, I had to just do one little modification to it. So this thing waters my whole garden. So leaving, putting this up keeps it from catching on this. And um, so when I put this up, it turns all the way around and then you have this nice and high and you're watering your whole 
garden in one swoop and I'll show you in a minute. But running it from the well, the well is really strong for this. So I have to put it on half strength. And so I put it on half strength from, because from the house, it won't run at all because we have so much hard water clogged in our lines in our house. Um, we're gonna put a whole new filter system on our house. So um, this will do the whole garden and just putting it in the middle of the garden here and uh, go all the way around. And it was like $27. I'll leave a link for you guys on Amazon if you're interested. Turn the water on halfway. Let on the hole. dog fencing to keep the dogs out of the garden because I have compost in there and they were getting in the compost. You can see it's going all the way around and it even hits to here. So, I mean, once the garden's at full where I have it all the way out to that tote right there, I'll have to move it twice. But for right now, this is doing my whole garden. Isn't that awesome, guys? Now, yes, I do believe on watering tomatoes from the bottom, but I just don't have the time, energy, money to buy the stuff that runs along the bottom for the tomatoes. Plus, I would have to separate the tomatoes from the rest of my area to do that, and which I probably will next year. But until then, this is what we have. And it works great. Thanksgiving and Christmas needs to be moved. Huh? Hey, I heard you gobbling all this morning, mister. I heard you gobbling. Can you see that guy right there? See how his thing is longer than the other one? That is a male turkey. Yeah. He's always trying to sneak out. He would take on my dogs but look at the difference in there is a large manure load still but they're not damaging the grass as much so super easy. Just got to get them some water. Some good stuff, huh? Looking for the good stuff. Yeah, these guys um, will have food available for them 24 seven. There's some bigger gaps in here, but these are bigger birds and not a whole lot is gonna come against them. As long as coyotes can't get in here, I'm not worried about it. Especially when they're this big. They are already bigger. They're 10 weeks old and they're already bigger than my heritage breed turkey that's over on the other side. These are meat breeds so they're meant to grow really quickly. My heritage breed grows a lot slower than these guys. Uh. 
Okay, that's what chores look like. Simple and easy without all those extra birds. Um, and a lot easier to move this chicken tractor with, uh, there was 12 birds, two turkeys in there. Um, next year we might do bigger flocks. Um, we can go up to 30 in the eight, six by 10, but I think that we should do maybe three rounds and spread it out a little bit more. So thank you guys. God bless you guys. And we'll see you next time here on Hedgehog's Homestead. Bye.